All right, so remember the good reminder for the weekend here that we're going to be setting our clocks back this weekend for daylight savings time. But for people living here in Ohio, that might be the last time we'll see that you make this adjustment. Yeah, so Ohio lawmakers are considering now making daylight saving time permanent. WLWT News Science Ashley Kirkland shows us how this could have an impact, a broader impact, Ashley, than just on your sleep schedule, which is what we focus on. That's right, Mike and Cherie. Well, if approved, this bill would require all of Ohio to observe permanent daylight saving time starting on March 8th, 2020, and it would never change again. Will Senators Chris Christina Rogner and Bob Peterson, they introduced the bill, also known as Ohio Sunshine Protection Act in March. Federal law says a state may exempt itself from the requirement to implement daylight saving time, but only if the entire state observes the standard time that otherwise applies during that period. The problem for our area is this would put Cincinnati and Northern Kentucky on different time zones, separated months at a time by one hour, potentially causing logistical and economical issues. The way a lot of back end mainframe systems are wired, um, their analysis is hardwired into data management, which that data management feeds into time analysis. So if that time analysis changes, therefore there's going to have to be a lot of programming done on the back end. Sounds like a lot of work and a lot of money. Those who oppose this bill bring up another major conflict this could pose with our airport, but that might end up not being such a big issue for us as it seems. Uh, a similar bill was filed in Kentucky in July, which could keep CVG and Cincinnati on the same time. Ashley Kirkland, WLWT News 5. Yeah.